All right, so here we go. We're gonna build a four to one pulley system, right? So you're gonna start off with your rope, the knot end of your rope, which usually is a figure eight on a bike, such as this, right? So because it is an even number and the mechanical van advantages, the knot is gonna go up or to the top. Odd number, like a three to one, the knot goes to the bottom. So some people like to do theirs on the ground, build it on the ground and then pick it up and hook it to their anchor point, which is up there. But I don't like to do that. I think it's much easier if you build it in your hand and then put the, uh, the pulleys where they go. So here we go. So I take my knot, which is gonna be up, right? And we're building a four to one. So I know that I need four ropes. There's two right there and two back there. I just made two loops is all I did, right? Let me do that again. One loop. Sorry, we got a call going on. One loop, two loops. And I simply put the pulleys in the loops where they belong. So, we're gonna take the first one and put it up top. It just makes it easier to hold, right? All I've done was set them in the loops that I've already made, close it up together, boom. I've got half of it made already, just that quick, right? So I take one of my carabiners, and hook it all together. And because my knot is gonna to go to the top, I'm gonna to hook it underneath right there at the bottom of the pulley, all right? With another carabiner. Top half is already put together with the knot up top, right? Now, at this point, you can go ahead and hang it up. Hey, buddy, buddy. Look at that, look how fast that was. Then you take your other double care uh, pulley. Place it on the bottom two loops. Boom. Your four to one is built just that fast. And that is your basic four to one. Okay. Pull over this side, down on that end. How simple was that? Alright, now you still gotta put a safety on there. That's where that pressure comes in. Take your press it. Opposite of the hall line. Here's my hall line. Technically it's the same line. It's just on the other side over here. Let me scoot y'all a little closer so y'all can see what I'm talking about. All right. So, hall line right there. This is opposite of the hall line. This is where your safety is going to go. Take your press it. Wrap around three times. Then you dress it up nice and pretty. Like that right there. Hook it in your carabiner, and now now you can haul like this. And then if you accidentally let go of the haul rope, it's, the, it's there. Just that easy. You got a four to one with the safe. So you lower it down there to you, to your patient. Up. And then you can easy peasy lift your patient up 
to safety. Oh no, I have a problem, I have to let go. Look at that. Y'all see that? Let me do it again. Oh no, I have a problem, I have to let go. Four to one, with the safety, lift up a 50 pound weight. Easy peasy. Now, what's the advantage of using an actual four to one? Is if you don't have very much manpower. Y'all saw how easy that was, just pulling it up one hand. If you don't have very much manpower, you don't have a whole lot of men to haul. Four to one, it's easy. What's the disadvantage? Is because for every four feet you pull on this, you only come up one foot on your patient. So you had to have a lot of rope. But, easy peasy, two double pulleys, a press it or a gift if you have a gift works even better. Three carabiners, and you haul them, baby. That's all it is to it. So, I'm gonna give y'all even closer upper. Let's lower this back down a little bit. Alright, so, got your haul line right there, right? Double pulley right there. Double pulley down below. Four ropes total. See the four ropes? That's why you, how you know it's a four to one. All in your weight. You lift up, you drop it, it don't go anywhere. Again, lift up, boom. And that is your basic four to one pulley system. Real fireman stuff.